So, look, before we get into this video right here, man, I'd like to give a shout out to Ben Harris, bro, for showing me and putting me on game. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Scott Jordan here. In this video today, I'm going to be showing you how to use your dark to live stream if you want to record songs live, mix songs live, anything on Twitch, Facebook Live, Mixer, Twitter, Periscope, whatever it is, man. I'm going to show you how to do that using all these streaming services using Streamlabs OBS. First, you're going to need Black Hole, so you need to go and download this. You can download it for Mac and you can download it for Windows. So, you can use Black Hole. It's really important you download this so what you want to do after you download and install black hole you want to find your audio midi setup your audio midi setup is going to be in here you're going to click on that it's going to come up you're going to see black hole here everything here so what you want to do is you want to create a multi output device all right and when you do that it's going to put the black hole and your interface together when you go into your dog you're going to want to choose multi output device for the output okay that's very important leave the input alone don't mess with the input multi output device do not choose black hole 16 channel right multi output device right click that boom we good so we got a mic signal coming through all right so here we go we go back in the stream labs and we're gonna go to audio and when you go to audio you want to go mic auxiliary device one you just put it on this right here, Black Hole 16 channel. All right, you hit done. So now we see we got settings down here and everything's rolling, right? All we got to do is see if we can get the auto tune on. So we got the auto tune. Yeah, yeah. We got the auto tune. We good. With our mic picking up. We good, right? So with that being said, you want to get our screen. So we want to get our screen up. So I already got mine selected. So how you add a source, you just go in. We want to be like window capture. Okay, add source. Then it's going to go through here. Like add new source instead. I could be like new logic. Whatever. It's there. Now I just got to choose. So look. I'm gonna go to desktop. All right, just just the desktop. Just so I can pull up everything that's on my desktop. And with that being said, I just find logic. Boom. Logic. It's there. I can hide this one. Lock that one. I'm on this logic, and now all I gotta do now is adjust my screen. Like what part of the screen that you want to show or how much you want to show. It's all up to you. Because, like, I really don't stream. I'm going to get into it, though. Because I really want to stream. I play Apex and I want to stream, like, recording songs and shit. Just fucking out just to kick shit with everybody, you know. Because I fuck with everybody, you know. So, so we got that set. So, just for this video purposes. So, that set. Um... All we got to do now is just turn on the live stream because I'm streaming to Twitch, right? So, I'm going to Twitch. As you can see on my phone, I'm going to play it. You're going to hear me on, you're going to hear me record. Then you're going to hear the delay on Twitch. So, this is Twitch, right? This is Twitch. I'm on Twitch. This is Twitch. Cool, cool. I'm on Twitch. I'm going to go live on Twitch right now just to prove a point. All right, so here we go. Mixing test. And um no. So here we go. Alright. So we streaming now. I should be live on Twitch right now. I should be live. I should be live. Think I'm live. I should be live. I should be live. I should be live. I should be live right now. I'm recording my screen so you see. I'm live. I don't tell me up. 
Auto-tune me, yo. Auto-tune me. It's a crazy delay, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should be live right now. So, like, I record my screen. I go back into it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could put delay on. Auto-tune me, yo. Put delay on. Auto-tune me, yo. Yeah, yeah. I don't tell me. Whoa. It's a crazy delay though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, like, I go back into it. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Like, I could put delay on. It's crazy, yo. It's crazy. I like delay on. I like this shit sound like, though. I like it. I like it's crazy, right? Yeah. It's crazy. Whoa. Crazy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Crazy, man. Let me start recording my screen. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. So, then you end the stream, right? Crazy, man. Let me start recording my screen. All right. So, look. Then you just stop the stream, right? But basically, that's how you live stream from Logic Pro. You can do that same thing from Pro Tools, Studio One, um, GarageBand, whatever DAW that you have. All you need is Black Hole. Create a multi-output device, right? Choose, make sure all these selected. You know, go into Streamlabs, OBS, OBS. Make sure you choose the correct setting. Just go to the audio. Again, audio, device one, mic one, 16. Click that. When you click that, you're going to have signal. And you're going to be good to go. You know what I'm saying? I showed you how to select the screen that you want to get to capture, and it's only going to show that, and you're good. All right, and then you have your chat over here, but that's how you use a DAW to live stream your audio. If you want to use Twitch, Facebook Live, YouTube, um, Mixer, whatever it is that you stream on, that is how you do it real easy, and it's real easy, man. Trust me. Really, really, really easy. But look, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's your boy Scott Jordan. I'm out of here, all right? Ha, ha, ha.